Hello, it's Matt M, and I think I have a problem. Hello everyone, it's Matt M. I make clinical laboratory science content videos every single week and if you are interested in that type of video, consider subscribing to my channel. This week will be a different type of video. I have been wanting to make one of these videos but I guess I was just scared because you guys have been expecting clinical laboratory science content videos but I really love unboxing stuff and then I thought that I would be sharing with everyone what I have been buying. Some of the things I bought are things that are essential to my job so I use them every single day so I splurge a little bit. So technically these are things that are essential for an essential worker. It's really nice if you treat yourself once in a while. So comment down below if you want tips on how I budget things, but how I usually spend things is that I list down the things that I want to buy all throughout the year. I usually write that on my planner and I will be making a planner video that will be coming up and then I save up on the things and then buy them in one go because I don't know if this happens in the Philippines, but in the States, we have have Black Friday and then the markdowns are real because I am a bargain hunter and I really really like things when they're discounted instead of buying for the full price I guess if they are things that are essential to an essential worker then I guess it's pretty good to just invest on the things that you will be using every single day and I actually lost track of the things I have already bought so Everything will be a surprise except this one because <laughs> I already know what this is. Let's go to box number one. What should I open first? This one. This one is from Amazon. Is it weird that I'm scared? Let's use my handy handy scissors. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, for my goal next year, I really want to invest on oral health. These are the Philips Sonicare Diamond Clean toothbrush heads and one of the packages that I will unbox later are for these exact brush heads. I don't know why the fates want me to open this one first. It doesn't make sense but I guess this video on this channel doesn't make sense either. So on to the next box. So, another Amazon package. Looks like this. Let's go for it. <laughs> the fates are with us. Because this box within a box, thank you, brother. This box is my toothbrush. It's perfect for the box I just opened the first time. This is the Philips Sonicare 9300 Diamond Clean Smart Electric Toothbrush. All throughout this year, I have been using a manual toothbrush and I saw some videos regarding this specific toothbrush and I find it to be really helpful for my lifestyle, especially that I work awkward shifts because sometimes I work day shift, I work night shift. And I think having this, this will motivate me to brush my teeth more. I'm sorry, but I'm just not religious and routine in brushing my teeth. I'm sorry, let's be real here. Who is? Maybe some people are. Maybe I'm the one that's wrong. Let's open it. It says welcome. That's so cute. Okay, what's in it? Instruction booklet? thingy. Okay, let's read that later. <laughs> yep, I'm one of those people. Oh my god, this comes with included brush heads. And I already bought four more brush heads. I have seven in total. Well, more brush heads for me. This is the toothbrush with the brush head. It has this cup thingy where you gargle. I, I just call it the mumugan. It also comes with this induction charge thingy that you use to charge. If you're not a fan of the mumugan look, there there is also another way of charging it. It comes with this. You dock it in like that and then you put the toothbrush up top. It's a little wobbly for me. Maybe I would stick to the cup because it looks more stable but I'm just holding everything on thin air so I can't be the judge of that. And it also comes in with a travel case that looks somewhat like this. 
when you open it up, it has that little well where you just plug in the toothbrush like that. Then you plug in the brush head like that. It has space for two brush heads. I think they also have specialized brush heads that you can use on different kinds of clean. And then you just close it like that. On to box number three. I guess we can just open up the most obvious one that we have right here. This is a Janu package. I remember buying new scrubs and a lab gown. So I pretty much know what's in it already. But then for now, let's just cut it open. <laughs> I think majority of this video would just be me trying to open packages really badly. Seal Blue Scrubs from Janu. That scrubbed up pants. Lab coat. What box are we in? Box number four. I'm so sorry, this is not a real unboxing. I am a faker. <laughs> but I already tested this out because I bought this shoe with my brother who's right there on the back. We bought it during Black Friday and they have a buy three 25% something off. And we really wanted to get a pair because we work in the laboratory and in the laboratory we're required to wear waterproof shoes so that we can avoid spills on our shoes so that it won't cross contaminate. That's pretty much the reason why I bought this. They make waterproof shoes that look very much like this they are knit shoes i tried spilling di water on my shoe what happened was it just dribbled away it really doesn't look like a waterproof shoe at first but then it is if i am working i really like the look of scrubs with white shoes i don't know are you in that squad do you wear white shoes to work okay box number five we have another box of scrubs. I bought a ton of scrubs because I work almost every day. So I need a lot of scrubs so that I won't be spending so much time doing my laundry because doing the laundry is hard. <laughs> For this one, I bought I think two new pairs. <gasps> Ooh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> okay, okay. I think I remember what I bought now. I bought a red one and a green one. I bought this because it's December and I want to be festive on the laboratory. Let's face it, no patient will see it, but I feel happy <laughs> wearing Christmassy related stuff. I expect me to wear this during my Christmas shift. Yes, sadly I'm working on Christmas and maybe I'll be wearing this green one sometime on my next shift. They also gave me this stethoscope and snowflakes sticker and I think it looks Cool, look at that. Look at that chrome. That looks nice. Anyways, drink your water. So, let's open up this one. They're along the lines. Ooh. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Okay. Everyone will now be spoiled on what I bought. This is the Apple silicone case for the iPhone 12 Pro Max. Let's pull the pull tab. And then, let's open it. It looks like that. It has the MagSafe ring inside. How can I explain a silicone case? I don't know. I guess the reason why I'm replacing my 7 to the current 12 Pro Max is because I don't think this form factor is working for me. I think I need a bigger phone. And my phone is starting to show its age by closing down the apps unexpectedly. And there's a nick on the bottom left corner of the screen. Another reason is I'm trying to justify what I just purchased. <laughs> <laughs> so let's open up this one. It says it has batteries inside, so I I think this might be it. <laughs> so let's open this up. Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? You see it? <gasps> this is the fruit of my labor. <laughs> let's unbox it. I'm sorry, it needs to be cut. It's on reverse. Yes, I do know that. But I just want you to hear this whole... Yeah. And this is on the Pacific Blue colorway. So guys, if you're excited, like this video. Because I am. <laughs> Wow, oh 
okay. That looks really, really good. Guys, I don't think the camera is justifying how much this blue color looks, but wow, this looks really good in person. It comes with the charging cable. It has a SIM ejector tool. Okay, at least that's still free. Thanks, Apple. And then I also get another sticker that I may or may not put in my Tumblr, but we don't care about that. Now the phone. Look at that blue, guys. Wow. I don't think you're seeing the full extent of its blueness. This is weird because they don't normally do this the paper thingy oh it has that little symbol if you can see right there it has a power button silent button the volume controls lightning that's a good addition it's time to unravel it let's just power it on we're gonna stop right there uh that's a good high. <laughs> okay, I forgot what box I'm in. Let's just go, let's just say, let's go to the next box. I bought this at Ross and I'm super surprised that they have the latest tempered glass for the iPhone 12 Pro Max. For the sake of me not regretting the way I put on my tempered glass, I will not show you guys. It's just your standard tempered glass, some wet wipes. A wet one and a dry one, and a microfiber cloth. Since this is the last one, I already know what's in it. And I'm very excited to use it. I don't want to tell you guys what's in it, but I guess everyone will just be surprised. Ooh, These are more Apple products. I'm sorry, you can see my cheapness coming out. This is the Apple 30 watt power adapter. I have been rocking the 7 for the longest time and I still don't have my own USB-C power adapter. I know everyone will say, but man, this 20 watt power adapter works. Why get the 30? And it's because I also bought the Apple MagSafe Duo charger. I guess this will forever live in my nightstand. Let's just pull the pull tab. Ooh, wow, okay, that's pretty tiny. It also comes with its own cable, USB-C to lightning, the same as the iPhone. And it's so tiny, look at that. It's as big as my palm. No, my palm's bigger. Imagine just carrying this, traveling without the burden of carrying two chargers. I guess that's pretty much it. How can I explain a charger? Let's do a quick look. It just charges it like that. It, it won't charge it because it's not plugged in, but it will look like that. With the phone, it would look like that. So if you're charging it on your nightstand, it would look something like that. I guess that wraps up this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did and if you guys want to see more of this type of content consider subscribing to my channel and like this video because it would really help my channel grow and I guess I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!